This one's for free. Oh boy. Wait, not for your big toe. Because your big toe wouldn't fit in this little ass thing, would it? <laughs> Beautiful. Wait, my pinky. Uh oh, the nail polish there just got ruined. Oh, we should maybe we should move on to the main segment, eh? Let's do what that. is our main segment? Ethan guessing beauty products. Okay. And I'm actually super excited because I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. <laughs> I had based on what I knew about dry shampoo, <laughs> which I'm still skeptical about, then I'm gonna be clueless. So, ladies, bring out the product. <laughs> one at a time, yes. Yeah, please. bring out one at a time. Okay, so again. The goal here is to bring out a woman's beauty, pro is it beauty products or across the board? Yeah. And I need to first guess what it is, what it does, and then I'll try it <laughs> if I can. Okay, so let's start. <laughs> okay, interesting. So here is, okay. So is this something that all women know what it is? Yeah. Really? Is it for f doing a finger in it? You put a finger in it? Oh. Oh. What kind of finger? A funger. <laughs> a funger? Like this? Do you hold it, do it like this? What kind of finger? Well... No? No. For painting nails? <laughs> You're super You're so close, close but would that's you need, not it. Would you need to hold your fingers that way, you think? If you were doing your nails? I think I've seen them do that in the beauty shop. <laughs> no. Beauty <laughs> shop. Wait, does it go like this then? What do you guys mean? That doesn't feel Come on, Ethan, you Just think, think outside the box a little bit. Cause I didn't know so either, but, but I feel like that was- Where else do you have nails on your body? Toes? Yeah. For toes? <laughs> oh, you would do this on your toes. Yeah. Can I I'll try it. <laughs> this one's for free. Oh boy. Wait, wow. your big toe? It's not for your big toe. Cause your big toe wouldn't fit in this little ass thing, would it? It does. Yeah. How do you do this? Yeah, hold on. <laughs> From this the seems, bottom. This is like challenging <laughs> logistically. <laughs> You need help to do this, or you guys do this by yourself? Oh my god, this is challenging. Hello. In um, no way. When you get your nails done, usually they there put this go. on. <laughs> Beautiful. Wait, my pinky. Uh oh, the nail polish there just got ruined. Yeah. <laughs> I guess, okay. So you just kind of let them. <laughs> no toes will overlap and you won't. Oh, my toes, dude. my toes need to overlap. Wow. Oh dude, my god. Okay, right okay. Yeah, they need a little... Stop it! A little, work. A little trim. Why is there like gunk under it? I don't know why that is. <laughs> Stop. Man. Why Brother, get... what? Ew! Stop it! Oh, yeah. Ew! Dude, Ew. you used to oh. be... Stop it, Jesus! Put those piggies away, man. I think it's probably to be sock uh, cloth. Oh, How can I get shit under my nail? I literally don't do anything. It's I from your socks. It's, it's from my socks. socks. Thank yeah. you, Zach. Yeah. That's what I figured. All right, remove that feet. I keep food. my feet clean, boy. Smell them, Eva. I want to smell feet. Vouch for them. No scent. Go ahead, smell it. You gotta vouch for me. <laughs> There's no smell. No scent. <laughs> See? To smell feet. You know what Theodore's been doing? Theodore started doing this. He puts his foot in his mouth and bites his foot nails. Then I don't know where does he learn that. I used to do that when I was a kid. I've done that too when I was a kid. It just seems like a good idea. But it's like, <laughs> it's crazy to see it happen in front of your eyes. Well, because I'm like, dude, don't do that. But then at the same time, I'm like, you remember? I've done that. Yeah. And nobody could stop me then. So I kind of just feet. sometimes just let it happen because I'm but like, we have to teach what him. can I do? Well, I say, I say. You know that's gross. Yeah. And you shouldn't do that. Yeah. I tell him, you know, we have the dogs walking and on the floor. And you're getting all kinds of crap in your mouth. Show yeah. feet. Because unlike me, he actually walks around outside barefoot and stuff. Did you guys all do that as kids? Bite your toenails? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is kind of a coming of age Just thing. humanity. <laughs> Every kid that ever lived figured at one point in their life that a good idea. Bad I idea. I need to bite my toenails. You figure out it's a good idea, but then you figure out it's a bad idea. Mm -hmm. Can I actually, I want to say I'm quite proud of myself. This is a new development in my life, but I think it's for the past year, or maybe two, I stopped completely biting my fingernails. Mm. Nice. nice. Like my whole life, I was biting my fingernails, and then one day I just stopped. Nice. Pretty crazy, right? That's, yeah. You know That's what big. it might be? COVID? No, the Wellbutrin. Oh, really? Because that helped me quit smoking. Like, when I started uh, that, I, like, had no desire to smoke. That's it has some kind of effect that helps you get over, like, addictive behavior. 
Um, but I yeah, wonder... somebody else was telling me that it helps with quitting smoking. They prescribe it for it to help people quit okay, smoking. Okay, okay. Yeah. It's so weird. I started taking it, and like Zach mm. used to be in front of the office smoking. Right. And I would always, I couldn't resist. Yeah. And then I showed up one day, he was smoking, and I just... Hey, how you doing? I easily uh, just didn't want to smoke. That was pretty interesting, eh? So there you go. All right, what's next? All right, so you didn't really pass this one, but almost. C-Man is running at the door. He's banging on the doors. He wants me to just... Oh, what the fuck? Okay, I think I know what this is because I... <laughs> I... <laughs> I, I've seen this in movies and shit. It's the uh, eyelash thing, right? Right. Yeah. But it, <laughs> I swear to God, I would have it. no idea what this was. Dude, you guys are like, how do you do this? This is like some Hellraiser shit. So <laughs> embarrassing. Whenever I see someone with these, it looks like, how are you doing that? Some medieval type of shit. <laughs> like, I've never done it. it you, you just slam your eyelashes a bit? To do yeah. what? To curl it. This curls? Yeah. Oh, I guess I, it's a curler. It's like moving them up more from, you know, going straight. Yeah, if I, I wouldn't want this near my face. Looks like <laughs> a torture device. <laughs> okay, so let's curl. It might, do I? No, you have you, to get real. You're not even near your eyelashes. It's so close. How close <laughs> do you need to get? It does feel so weird. Oh, I'm being told that's his actual, that's his actual Be careful. Face. You're so... So am I close enough? How can I get any closer than that? You're like I can't. completely not. <laughs> that looks funny as shit. Jeez. Maybe look you at the You see that, camera. love? What am I supposed to do about this? I don't know, dude. I heard you say G, so I thought maybe you were shocked by it too. Would it help you if you're looking at. Did this? I get it? Alma. Your eyes are supposed to be open, actually. That might help. Keep your eye open. Keep my eye open? <laughs> yeah, because you're you're clamping the top. It's dangerous. Not the bottom. <laughs> All right, bring the camera back because I can use that and then the beautiful. Okay. Close-up shot, boy. What are you doing? doing? I can't. I don't okay. think. <laughs> Does that look right? No. Way too hot. Way too hot. You'll feel when your eyelashes are oh, sandwiched it looks in. Like it's about to go in my eyeball. Right there. Did I get them? No. <laughs> you want me to curl yeah. them? Yeah. yeah. So, somebody help me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I do feel like it's important for me to do this myself, but I think I'm just too scared. Like, the first time someone did makeup for me, and they make you look up, look down. See, so you guys have all these hacks. Look down, look up. Ah! <laughs> You're okay. You didn't hurt me. It's just shocking. I never had anybody touch my eyebrow like that before. My eyelash. Get down. Ah. 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 Ah, that feels so weird. Ah, I took it down. <laughs> Did you get a shot of that? Oh, great. Damn, was out there doing God knows what. <laughs> oh, that is very important. That is important. <laughs> I give it that. I give it that. <laughs> All right. That was an adventure. Well, you knew this one. I didn't know that one. So I guess I... I'm one for two. I didn't. I don't think I really got the first one. I don't think that counted. No, the fact that you put it on your hand mm -hmm. was like. Yeah, I guess we wouldn't really need that, would you? <laughs> no. The finger spread. Is this the new one? Is it edible? <laughs> it's something makeup related. <laughs> I mean, what else could it be? <laughs> is this a diva cup? <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait, is that what it's called? A diva cup? <laughs> Uh, it's gross. <laughs> Wait, what's it called? The cup that some women use for um, periods. Menstrual cup? I thought it was called a diva cup. That is a thing. Oh, it is? So there's a diva okay. thing. <laughs> That's not a diva cup. It's absorbent. <laughs> right. Doesn't do that, though. Some, this has obviously been used before. <laughs> it is? <laughs> I mean, I'm assuming maybe for dabbing. For dabbing. Okay. A butt plug? <laughs> Dan suggests a butt plug. Yeah. It's a dabber. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, it's called a beauty it. blender. I've beauty, done enough. I've done beauty enough. Beauty blender. A beauty blender. So do you dab or do you blend with it? 
You do all that you want. Oh, everything with it. you ever. Yeah. <laughs> I've done enough makeup through Frenemies and beyond. Right. I've seen this mm -hmm. kind of shit. Or as James Charles says, blend. Don't blend in. So true. So true. The star. The star. Yeah. That's my advice to him in jail, incidentally, as well. This is weird. That is some bullshit. Okay. This is definitely like some kind of veterinarian tool for removing like ticks. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Can I say I don't know what is this? Oh, so this is niche, perhaps. It's shaped. It looks like a tweezer. It's shaped like an eyeball for eyeball use. Okay. Really? I. Okay. For eyeball use. You okay. both, if you were, if you oh, work I know, together, I know, you know, I know exactly. I know. It's a fake eyelash putter yep. on her. Uh, yes. Yeah. I'm clapping about it. <laughs> Dude, I'm good at this, boy. Nice. <laughs> yes. Okay, what the fuck are these? <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo, I don't know what this is, I have but I want to use them. I've never seen this. What is this? Are those Benoit balls? Okay, so what? this is full of some kind of blue liquid. There's a nice little handle on it, which means Goo. it's active. <laughs> The, ha the handle implies active use. Mm. You want a good grip on this thing. It's not a weapon. Is it used in is sorcery? It, like... it looks magical. Yeah. Yeah. That's, 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 that would yeah. be my guess. Is it one of these? Okay. Mm. What does it do? This shit doesn't actually work, does it? It uninflames. Wait, one of what? What is supposed to happen? <laughs> so I, what I've seen is there's a rock with a roller. Right. And people, they roll it like here. Yeah, but I don't know why. This has, like, that's this not is that. different. This is oh, like... this is not that. So what is this? This you keep in the fridge. Okay. Yeah. And then um, you like, it feels really good under your eyes in the morning. It like mm. deep puffs and it wakes you up. So it's just putting an ice pack on your face. Okay. <laughs> but it's beautifully so shaped more... and it's it, aesthetically it looks, pleasing. But it looks cool. It's very beautiful. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Ah. I mean, fair enough. Yeah. Ah, so nice in the morning. <laughs> so refreshing. Hello, dear. Good morning, my queens of TikTok above 18. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, you guys have all these gadgets and shit. I would never think to buy something like this. Like, how do you all find out about these kinds of gadgets? You keep them in the freezer? You have food in your freezer or just this kind of shit? No, there's like a little fridge that people keep like moisturizers or really? all kinds of stuff in. Chantal bought one of those, and I'm like, why Why do you have this? <laughs> and it's in our room, and it's like a little beer fridge. I'm like, can I put beers in there? Or anything? I'm like, what, what is the yes, point of this? There's a, a skincare fridge. Yeah. Amazing. She, she was <laughs> so excited about it. It's, it's, they are so cute. Oh, wait, I want a beauty fridge. I vote you should get one. <laughs> we and so what do you one. keep in there, except like these? Do you have one of these? What do you keep in there, Sam? Well, you're not Mike. Do you want to come here? I keep all of my ordinary stuff in there, actually. Oh. Yeah. Why do you keep makeup in it? Or what not, or like uh, moisturizer? Um, and well, it makes it just feel so good when it goes oh, on. Okay, okay. And I, I also keep like my, I have those things and I keep those in there. So yeah. These exact ones or something? No, else? I have something somewhere. So w w when you, can you, when you use them, is it first thing in the morning type of yeah, thing? Yeah, in the morning or at night. And do you after apply the them? After gym, it hits after the gym. Do you apply them over your eyes like this or does it go no, under? you just kind of roll them around. Like they're, this? They're called facial uh, globes. I have the box. Facial globes. Facial yeah. globes. Is, am I doing this right? Like this? Yeah. Or is it like this? You're doing it. You're almost right. Mm. What's, you can just kind of like... Roll them around. I, I mean, you can freestyle, you know, whatever feels good. There you go. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Oh, if you'd like, like some, 50% uh, off right How now. How much are these? I think I paid like 15 bucks. Huh. Okay, not too bad. Well, there's not much going on. You said on like 70, I would have been like, <laughs> oh, okay. I'm sure you can buy some for like 500 if you look. It's 14! They're like, the water is specifically <laughs> enhanced. When is the. Uh, uh, Radiate. Calco? She's the the goop lady, right? Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. She probably sells a thousand dollar one. She's gonna need it <laughs> after this. She has some case. fuck, dude. <laughs> kind of interested in this stuff. It feels good. Did you have? It does it? feel good. You try it. I have. Just Eyeball now, globes. It feels really good. Like even though this is not in a fridge, it feels cold. It does. Why does it, it feel so it cold? Feel like, like... Oh, they were. Oh, they were. Oh, okay. we did it right. Uh, and uh, yeah. I feel this. 
<laughs> Yo, like I'm gonna, we're gonna have to share the picture of our beauty fridge. <gasps> We're gonna and to... sometimes you know what's funny i already have a little fridge because i at one point had a coffee machine is it just a normal in fridge? our room what's the temperature like this little tiny one does it get cold enough oh uh, well the one chantal guy that this ain't no normal fridge <laughs> what's the special? tell me about it where, where i don't, don't know it's a fucking fridge it's like this big and it's got a little fucking door <laughs> and i'm like <laughs> Why? Why do you have this? It's cold and so I at some it point like beautiful fridge, for you, Zach. <laughs> at some point, I had this dream of like I want to wake up and just have coffee in the bedroom. So I got this little tiny fridge and I put like half and half in it. Yeah. See that I, I can that. justify. Like, that, <laughs> that makes sense. Is there space for a beer in there for you? Can you share the space? No, there's not, and that's what upsets me. So it is that. It's like yeah. tiny. Oh, so we have yeah. that. We have that. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta get some globes. Okay, yeah, fantastic. if you put if you put a little gloves. like oil on your skin, then it you can like it. glides around oh. super beautifully. Is that how you do it, Sam? You glide with oil? Yeah. Oh. Isn't putting oil on your skin unadvisable? Depends on your skin. <laughs> okay. It totally depends on your skin. Yo, okay. <laughs> okay. So this is something I un not unwrap. It seems permanent. Or can you replace the plastic? Um, you can. Is it? E oh, I see. It peels right off, right? Breasts. No, it comes right off. It looks like raw chicken. Breasts. <laughs> it looks like schnitzel. <laughs> Throw this in a fryer. I have a good old time. Yeah, the, the, the plastic comes right off. It's sticky though. Stinky. It's so it's funny how you smell everything. <laughs> I have a. You know what? It is interesting. You have, always smell everything. <laughs> I feel that I have a good sense of smell. <laughs> if you've not smelled what sneezes smell like, then you're not on my level. <laughs> I know exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> are fucking so nasty smelling, yep. but also really compelling in a weird way. <laughs> it's just so unexpected and weird. Okay, so, so there are some fellow sniffers out there. Not that I'm going to gather any useful information, but... Uh, it's very sticky. I have a feeling I wasn't supposed to do that. No, you were. You were. Actually. Oh, for real? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so there's glue. So it's glue. So you still don't know what it is. So I'm assuming you put it over your titty. Yeah. yeah. If you're wearing a dress or something yeah. and you want to keep your boobs. You nice. got it. Oh, so, okay. I didn't know that you guys had a whole thing like this. <laughs> well, give it a shot. So does it go up like this that <laughs> way? Yeah. Out? yeah. But is, you know what? Sometimes hair? I actually don't know which way to hold them. I'd okay. just guess. Because there's an obvious top I and bottom. I feel like, I feel like, and I don't know if I'm right, I would do it that way. Yeah. Oh, that way? But that's not symmetrical. Like, <laughs> wait. Wait, I think that's so confused. <laughs> nope. These are so big. But actually, I can <laughs> see that this would be really nice. Did you guys get it for like Ethan's size? <laughs> Damn, that's hugging my titty in there. You can see it. <laughs> Hell yeah, boy. I, I can see that if you're wearing a dress or something form-fitting, that this would really... It keeps your nipple flat, so you don't yeah. your nipple, and also it probably really complements your form. Yeah, no straps showing. No strap. This is cool. Oh. This is a cool... <laughs> Although it looks expensive, Is this right? gonna hurt? Or do you reuse it? You reuse. How many is times Is it gonna you... hurt? Yeah, no, it hurt. doesn't Okay, <laughs> I'm like... That Honestly, mine's been sticky is for like at least half a year. Really? Yeah. That, these adhesives are really good. Yeah. And what's interesting is it doesn't stick. Actually, that hurts. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. It does hurt. That's what I was scared of. You were pulling it from Just here. Just keep it mom. I was like, oh, it doesn't hurt. <gasps> so how much are, do these cost? Because they seem like nice. Okay. And you can use them for a little while. Yeah, you get a few uses. <laughs> That's sure. awesome. I would feel like if I was a lady, I'd wear these. Does it actually stay on? Bitch this had... shit ain't going anywhere on me. Wait, what happens if you put the shirt on? Does it yeah. accentuate? <laughs> uh, Let's try. Yeah. Because... I like the way they're concaved <laughs> in this one. Yeah. <laughs> Did I not put it on right? I think you just took your, yeah, you took your fingers. Oh, right. Because, well, I don't actually have boobies. It's so. true. I think usually it probably fit the natural curvature. What if you start sweating? It's hot. It's a long night. You can see the slipping. Coming out. That happens. It lasts. <laughs> it, it doesn't come off.
So all, all women know about this. Yeah. And when do you learn about this? My first time learning about this kind of stuff was when I was getting ready for my sister's wedding. So I was already mm -hmm. like sister's wedding. 26 or something. Sister's wedding? We were together then. Right. You're I like was, like was like going to wear adult. a dress. Yeah, an adult. I was going to wear a dress and like you couldn't wear a bra with it. And they're like, oh, you can just put stickers or something. Mm -hmm. And I was like, uh, what? This is more than a sticker. Uh, but that was my first time learning about like other options. What do you call this thing? <laughs> really? Yeah. Y'all didn't think of a better name than that? <laughs> Sam said sticky boobs. Sticky, sticky boobs, sticky how about, bra. How about sticky titties? I like <laughs> sticky titties. <laughs> E-T-T-T. -t -t Alright, let's see how this Ditch. affects the curvature of my body. Stunning. Real alpha behavior, guys. Absolutely. But here, people in the chat are saying around high school and prom, they yeah, learned like, about it. A formal dress. That makes sense. That makes sense. Here, let me tuck in so you can kind of fit the form. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, <laughs> hands to yourself. He's got little mosquito bites. <laughs> oh my god. You see it? Yeah. What is that doing anything for you? Really? Our little Ethan is growing up. Excuse me. <laughs> my face is up here. A budding woman. Pardon me, Ella. A little respect. You guys can do a TikTok now that the nips are covered. Oh, true. <laughs> I do an alpha TikTok like this. A thirst this. trap. <laughs> you guys want to watch me sit quietly for another minute? No. Every budding beauty. No. <laughs> the budding beauties. Let's see how's my uh, TikTok doing, by the way. Olivia said mosquito bites. I have not heard that probably since middle school. And that's the <laughs> meanest fucking thing a guy so could mean. say. It's, it's so fucking it's mean. So mean. Uh. It's so mean. It is so mean. I meant it with love today, though. No, I, yeah, I yeah. know. Yeah. I know. So, but... Like, back when I was in high school, did this exist? Because I don't think so. I feel like these are n new inventions. Yeah. You know what's interesting? Like, there's a lot of new inventions that I'm noticing that are, like, improving people's lives and stuff like this. But it's not, like, technological advances. So where's this been? It wasn't like, oh, we discovered... It's just, like... Teddy fabric. I think there's so many like individuals like what you see on Shark Tank. They're like, hmm, here's a little problem, and I have an idea for this very specific so thing. Many. Just so many. I'm just gonna make this one product and sell it on Amazon. You know, it's like there's all this like you have ways to do that now. <laughs> I don't want to waste these. Does anyone want to take these home and use them? <laughs> Hila? That is not my size. Oh, is that a big cup? Yeah. It's a D. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for. Thanks for that. Fantastic. Oh, <laughs> well. oh shit. I'm gonna move this out of the way. Let me put my shirt on for Christ's sake. <laughs> what are we eating tonight, Hila? We should get something good, right? Yeah. I've been on that tostada run. Mm -hmm. That was crushed, dude. I swear to God, right? Really. And Teddy wanted one. Oh, yeah, he did. Although... That bathroom break I had middle of the show yesterday <laughs> was definitely I was motivated. thinking, yeah, because there were like um, frozen pizza and I was thinking, no, it's the Mexican food. It's the amount of salsa <laughs> I put on it. I yes. It. Okay. So we have some kind of brush, but it's rubber, gentle, gentle rubbing bristles. I don't know what this is. Budding beauty. Wait. Am I far off? Because this feels kind of good. You're right. I am? Yeah. How do I get all this stuff right? <laughs> I don't no. know. You're Tam. one of the girlies. Did you? <laughs> Tam. I'm... That feels so, so good. Really? So what do you do with it? Is it too... You, want, you, you can use it when you're washing your hair. Mm. And a lot of people think that, like, follicle... Oh in, yeah, Stimulates. and it, like, promotes growth and stuff. Oh, for uh, real? Mm-hmm. I use that. I think it is really helpful. It's good for like cleaning your scalp too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh shit! I should use. You guys have all these good products. Why don't you share with us? <laughs> Why y'all keep it secret? <laughs> this is literally the point of the segment. Wait, share I, and tell right I now. I want this Dude, in the shower. I've never I'm seen telling this. you, women has everything figured out. It's crazy. Hilo, <laughs> why are you it's holding crazy. out on me? I didn't know about all this stuff. So we need to we need to get on the crane. I need this. So you want to try it, or we'll fuck up your hair probably. Yeah. Oh yeah, dude. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, yeah, you dude. wash your hair and use it with a shampoo? Yeah, right? With shampoo? Mm -hmm. 
I was thinking originally maybe a foot scrubber. No. But sometimes you gotta scrub your foot, right? But I think those are more serious. How does it work with long hair though? It does? <laughs> Probably when it's wet with shampoo. Yeah. Because you ladies wash your hair once a week, so you want to get in there with all the gadgets, mm -hmm. right? Mm. Okay. So when you ladies wash your hair, it's like a big event for you? I don't know if like it's a big a event. Week? It's definitely, I plan on it. You get in there with all your it products. It depends if you plan on, like, if you need to blow dry it after or something, mm -hmm. then it becomes it can a be whole kind of ordeal. Right. You got to prep yourself. It's not like any other shower. Yes, it's and everything, everything shower. shower. You shave. Also, mm -hmm. for you me, wash. since oh, I started bleaching my hair, I'm trying to not wash it as much. So, like, once a week is what I'm doing. Wow. Mm -hmm. but, it, you... it, but you don't need, actually, to because it doesn't get as oily. Women have secret lives from men. I like oh. this. We're doing a knowledge sharing. Intel. You know mm -hmm. when like America and UK had an Intel sharing agreement? I'll share my secrets with you. I don't have any though. <laughs> but I will share what I know. Somebody said for Curly Her, it's a big event. Right. Yeah. Okay, I'm feeling this though. Nice. Is this expensive? It seems like a nice product. This was five bucks? It seems well made, doesn't it? Yeah. It's fucking cool it right now, dude. It's cool right now. It's e eco tools, you guys. What, is it, what does it feel like? like Get on this. Experiencing right now? You know what I always think about, though? Shit like this is probably the kind of crap that uh, Sebastian's airdropping from China for like two days. Oh, yeah. Days. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, I for sure have bought products of his on Amazon. <laughs> Let me think about it. Hold on. Kind of nice. Styles my hair a little bit, eh? Yeah. <laughs> this as a comb, perhaps. <laughs> Me? Just you. <laughs> All right, well, I this, you. <laughs> this I know what it is, because we talked about it. Right. I've never used it. Oh, it feels so cold. Was this in the fridge? No. Oh, it huh. feels so cold. Do you, do you use this, Hilo? I don't. So what is this supposed to do for me? The jade roller. It helps with, um, like, drainage in your face. Drainage, so I'm po I'm squeegeeing out blood from my face. That's the idea. <laughs> I don't know if it's blood. Well, what else it then? What fluid? What other fluid would be under? Isn't my skin? it doing kind of like the same thing as the other yeah. one? Well, the other one you make some sense because you put it in the fridge, and you make it cold. It's like holding. You ice could do it with this face. one this too, right? This... You could put this one in the fridge too, I think. I've seen this one. This one's pretty popular right now, right? Right. But mm -hmm. you guys know, and I, I don't want to be the, I don't want to be like the hater, but it is kind of who I am and it's my job. You guys know this doesn't do anything, right? I don't know so about that. When I was growing up, I'd, <laughs> I don't There's no know if shot this thing, thing, thing does yeah. shit. I think no, absolutely. No, wait, I didn't want to be the one to say it. No, it when I grew things. up, oh, was growing up, I, I don't know if this People even existed. Limp yeah. So I never got into it. Yeah, like I don't limp use it. I don't know training. much about it. Hmm. But I guess the, maybe the beauty culture is different there. Or I don't know. No, I think it's just a. I think it's generation. The time. You're yeah. old. You're old, dude. Like we didn't get to grow up watching like makeup videos on YouTube. Do you know how much That's that true. that would have changed my whole life? <laughs> That's true. It, it changed my whole it's life. It's part for of the sure. re like I never knew what People the hell you do with notes. YouTube uh, the with makeup. What lymph nodes are you guys ta talking about? Do I have lymph nodes in my face? I know at the end, they always tell you to go like this. I know I have lymph nodes there, but yeah. how, what is this doing for them? I think that like you push the fluid down and it drains. A, you know what I'm saying. Shot, I don't know if I'm saying it right, but a gua sha does that a lot better. Yeah. Cause it's like really pinching your skin. All right, I'm just gonna put this out there. You guys can call me an idiot and stupid, but Nothing's pushing fluid nowhere. <laughs> that's my. Right, it's just, you know, I'm just a hater ass bitch and I just gotta express you. myself. And you're probably right. It's, it seems like kind of a. It probably feels good though. It does. Which is good, which is kind of all you need, right? I'm assuming this isn't actually made of jade. <laughs> it would work if it was. The jade is important. Real quick, I don't have much time. It's like shaving. I'm gonna get another rash. Oh, shit. 
What the? F oh, are these just stickers? This is the next one. I only now started to see these, like maybe a couple months ago, for the first time. I think it's more of a recent thing. My sister-in-law, um, she went to Korea and she brought me some of those over because I, they weren't here yet at the time. Because I'm always That's putting band-aids on my face when I have a cut. So, she... can I open this, baby? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It says not safe for work, but it's fine. I need to marry a smart, beautiful girl with zero ego. <laughs> I love that. He's like so much ego, she practically doesn't even exist. So little ego, <laughs> she's basically lobotomized. But if you scroll through the photos, it's you just... must look like this. Yeah. Uh -huh. Bunch of girls in now. You yeah. must look like her. You must look like... Why this one? You must be sadly... You must be sad look, car. You must be sadly longing for a better relationship. <laughs> <laughs> she seems like, oh, I just had an argument with my boyfriend. Can't wait to dump him. You must be like this. Dude, you are so fucking shallow and sad. Mm -hmm. It's just funny because he said he wouldn't want his wife walking around like that, but that's his yeah. dream wife right there. That is oh, interesting. That's, that's an excellent point. That is just from last year too. So, but no, nobody owns that those women yet. Right. The, you need to find that right, person and then cover her up. Right. Exactly. <laughs> it's crazy. All right. So we back to the hard stickers. I'm assuming that these are not for scrapbooks with stationary, <laughs> stationary scrapbook. <laughs> mm -hmm. In a book. <laughs> <laughs> no scent. Uh-huh. Well, I've seen Ela doing first, this like kind a of ah! scent. Is it is it like for makeup looks? It's not. What the fuck? This so this one's really stumping me. Because mm -hmm. I've seen you wearing this type of shit in your recent looks. Right, like a decal. But it's not this, or it's something else. Doing the makeup and then taking it off. Oh, they use decals to do that? It's not something on your face? No, it wasn't actually on my face. Huh. It's an adhesive heart. Not very expensive, so it's definitely disposable, right? Mm -hmm. For one time use. Well, I think I found a use for it, and I don't really care what you girls do it with. <laughs> okay. So you know what this is, Hila? I know only from very recent, like two months ago. I started seeing it everywhere all of a sudden. Why don't you try putting one on your tongue? <laughs> No. What? I know you're fucking with me. <laughs> no, no, not that dumb. Yeah. Okay, fine. No, I'm not that dumb. I was just gonna make a joke that they're acid tabs. That one. <laughs> and I just, and I just <laughs> dosed you, motherfucker. Here's we got a, drunk here's last a week. Hint, this now we're comment. going real off the rails. I wish I had this during puberty. Okay, so it's meant to cover blemishes. Now, why would you want to do that? Um. Are you disagreeing? Are they used to cover them? That's part of it. There's more mm -hmm. to it. Is this medical? Yeah, oh. you like you put it on overnight. Or oh. At least that's what I do. Wait, this is medical? So I've seen people at work having like they'll just have one on their face, and then I'm like, oh, I've never oh my seen God, that before. That's such a great fucking idea. Wait, yeah. so how does it work if it's medical? What is in it? Hydrocolloway patches. It's supposed to suck all the gunk out of a pimple. Does it work? Yeah. Huh. <laughs> Holy fuck. I should have vented these years ago. I've been wearing band-aids on my face for like 10 fucking years. Dude. I just want to look like Nelly. Okay. That too. <laughs> this is fucking awesome. Yeah. Pimples were like the bane of our Yeah, distance. so embarrassing. So not only can you cover them, although you're not supposed to wear this out, right? You just put wear it People overnight. do it wear it like out. It sounds like you can, which... I think it's a good idea. I Why might not? start doing That's that. That's how I, I only started noticing like two months ago. I've seen people, they wear it out. There's like clear circular ones too. They're not all like hearts. But I'd rather look cute than be right. like, look like I have a band aid on my face. <laughs> me yeah. too, girl. God me forbid. Too. Can I get a hit of one of those? I have a zit on my face right now, actually. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let me hit that. And Let I love, like, that. I don't know how accurate it is, but you know, you can like see the oil build up when you take it off the next day. So you feel like it's done so much. Mm. Oh. You're like, oh, wow, look at all of the stuff wow. that's not in my face anymore. Can I put a theory forward? <laughs> Again, not to be a hater ass bitch, but is it possible? Here we go. That you have this thing, you p cover your pimple, and it, what it really does is prevent you from picking at it and trying to pop it and shit. And then it heals naturally. Yeah, that's interesting. Maybe. That's 
that's 100% what happens with me. That's what I'm doing, for sure. Mm. Which is mm. still valuable mm -hmm. service. Yeah, but your face is, like, oily. You could do that with a piece of paper. It's oily. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, I feel like, and absorbing Sam it says, out okay. still be beneficial if it's getting it oil out, out. Of Sam says so. you can see a perfect white dot of where the, uh... The gunk. The disgusting pimple juice was. Oh, I'm being told that's his actual, that's his actual face. I'm so sorry, Ethan. Dude, that... <laughs> <laughs> the, um... <laughs> I would kill for those, man. And yeah. if it actually works, like, holy fuck. Yeah. Right. I'll tell you what, I can't wait to show our boys, like, healthy, actual skincare routines. Because mm. growing up in middle school and high school, I did not know anything. And, like, I would wash my face, like, ten times a day because it was so oily and I felt disgusting. And I now know that that would make things worse. It was, like, dry and oily and I just felt disgusting and uncomfortable in my skin all the time. And I wish that I had somebody to tell me what to actually do about that, so. That's what I'm think saying. That... Everybody's growing up now with so much information. You can watch a video about, oh, wow. like, skincare. You can watch a video True. about makeup, how to do your hair. People talk about the dark side of social media, but here you're talking about As a teenager, the positive side I of mean, social media. I went on a few period cycles not knowing how to put a tampon in because I, I had nobody to ask. I was too embarrassed. Nobody taught you how to do that? Your no. mom? No. Huh? <laughs> so how did you know to do it? A friend was like, you just put it in and I would try and it, I was like, I don't know, I'm doing something wrong. I can't figure it out. That seems <laughs> pretty wild that no, that your mom didn't show you. I think I was embarrassed. I was like, but, but she I think it's it. common. Well, did you, did you guys have uh, some advice? When I was, to... I did. Um, I do know that a, a lot of girls if their parents just didn't want to talk about it, it like the sex talk. Yeah, like my parents don't talk about, it. they wouldn't talk about anything embarrassing. Like, yeah. There was no it's sex like, talk, there was no... It. Yeah. That surprised me. I don't think my mom even ever used a tampon. So she wouldn't even know what to tell me. Mm -hmm. I, I know mm -hmm. girls in my hometown pads. had to hide it from their pads. parents. Pads. Yeah. I see pads. That's mm -hmm. like the old lady shit, right? Pads. Yeah, but I was going to swim classes. So I just Love. like didn't go. <laughs> okay, I see. So she thought you just use pads, which yeah. is like obvious. Yeah, but I was like, I was. Pads. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's that's tough, man. That's hot, tough. It's just know. like the lack of information. You just you don't know. Yeah. You now you can just Google how do I put in my tampon. You can. I'm sure you can. And then you have yeah. a bunch of eight, fifty year old, <laughs> fat white dudes in the comments being like, Yes, tell me more. <laughs> Let's no. get another video. <laughs> Show me another video from a different angle. Okay, so here's the next one. This is, you guys love stones. Another <laughs> type of stone with soft edges. I'm assuming it's the same shit. You just kind of like, I'm getting the fluids out, guys. Guys, I'm getting the fluids out of my face. Is this what it is, Sam? I think it is. <laughs> Okay, what's the what does it do? Yeah, that's this one. That's supposed to make my jaw. Oh, this. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay, you guys know that doesn't work. Oh, I didn't know that. That's where it goes. <laughs> well, it's supposed to wait. What push does it do? Your lymph nodes right here, and so you're supposed to like take it, take it, take it, and then bring it down. And it's supposed <laughs> supposed to drain the fluid. <laughs> What fluid? What is this, all this fluid you guys are walking around? Well, there is limpic fluid that flows. I, I would it up. So you got your lymph nodes back here, right? But they don't get collecting. big unless you're sick. But, but the thing is that they're they're a, they're collecting lymphatic fluid from like your ears and your uh, like tear ducts and stuff that nice. builds up and it drains to there. Okay. So that is a real thing. Now whether or not you need to like uh, knead it like dough to like get it out of your system, if that's actually beneficial. From what I was Googling around, there's not really a whole lot of scientific evidence. There's anecdotal evidence, <laughs> as evidenced by all, everybody swearing by it in this room, so. <coughs> yeah, well, there's anecdotal evidence that uh, all meat diet is uh, healthy. There's about <laughs> as much support for both, scientifically, so. Okay, Chew I mean, it's on fun. That. It actually feels really odd when I get to here, which I'm assuming is where the lymph nodes are. It makes me want to cough. What? <laughs> uh, <coughs> <laughs> okay, well, that's weird. <laughs> Maybe put the gua sha down? 
So do you do your whole jawline or just the limp piece? The jawline, and then you do like under your cheekbones. I've never. Seen Some girls it? post TikToks where they say that if they they like run it up on their eyebrow yeah. a bunch, and then they say that it like it's a natural facelift, and there is no part of me that believes that. <laughs> like never once will I fall for that. It's personally, I don't and like again, I just gonna say I'm sorry, but that sounds as believable to me as the this other. This one I don't that. really no. like. I like the other stuff. It felt nice, but this. This one, one doesn't even feel nice. No. Mm. I do see people doing this though. I see people like talking on TikTok or they're like on the phone or they're doing something totally unrelated. <laughs> they're just like, yeah, so anyway. <laughs> okay. You got your next product here. What is this called? Oh, uh, what is that called? Gua sha. <coughs> like, like go gua sha? Gua sha. Gua sha, like guano. That shit. We all learned that, of course, from Ace Ventura. That's right. That is true. That is where I learned where guano, or what guano was. We oh. all, one year, all found out what guano is. Somebody <laughs> said I call it Joshua. <coughs> Joshua, because it's unwanted. And annoying. Um, you can get fancy Lux pads that are super thin and have memory foam. We live in the future, Mouse Eyes says. What's the, what does that mean? Lux pad? Oh, is that? That's a lux pad. Oh, like for menstrual? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, Black Panther says, as someone with afro hair that dries out, instead of getting oily, I was never told I can't use standard shampoo, hotel, etc. I get, I learned at twenty six. That's actually a big deal for mm -hmm. me too, because I have that kind of. Well, I have, mine is oily, but it's super thick and curly. That. So what do you use? I wonder. Me? No. Oh, I don't know. There's like, dude, there's so many types of shampoo, dude. All right. God damn. All right, here's the next one. Nair. Oh, I know what Nair is. I think we know what Nair is because... Face cream, though? Wait. Okay, because I know what Nair is because we were trying to remove my hair for a video we shot back <laughs> in the day in New York. What was that? What was it? Was it oh was it one of the like we're buying all black product or something like that? Was it part of I don't that? I remember. But in the end, I didn't. Everyone told me not to use it. Oh no! Oh right. People convinced me. That not was something to do else. It. Yeah, you were gonna use it on your face or something, and they said don't. Okay, so or no, I was gonna use it on my asshole and. On your ass. Okay, I remember. Oh god. <laughs> I was saying that I wanted to try because people were saying that. <laughs> One of my, or I think it was a friend or something. They're saying they shave or their whole asshole, and that it's good. That it's good. So I said I'm gonna nair everything, <laughs> and it was advised that that wasn't a good place for nair. Yeah, that's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> we had the product ready. I had like three bottles of it. <laughs> okay, but nair face cream moisturizing <laughs> formula. I see that you blacked out some of the uh, giveaway information. <laughs> Dermatology tested. Can I read the back? Or is that cheating? So, okay, so let me let me take a guess. Is there is it to remove like peach fuzz and stuff? Okay. Mm -hmm. There you go. See, I know everything. How do you there know you that term? Well, I know sometimes women get whiskers, uh, this, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? <laughs> whiskers. The nair seems like a- so the nair really works, though, eh? I don't like it. It hurts. Oh, it hurts. It, like, stings, kind of. The... You, you gotta go talk Ew. to the mic, uh, talking soon. Oh, yeah, we gotta get- could we just get her a mic? Because she's talking a lot. Right. I mean, if we- if we can set it up real fast. Yeah, have you ever used an air? Sam, you can sit in my seat if you want no, to bring something. No, I've I've waxed many times, but I never used an air. Smells like burning hair. Ew. All right, well, there's a picture on the front of this one of some kind of pad over the uh, oh. reproductive area. Okay. Or if you can't reproduce. The lower abdomen to be inclusive as possible. <laughs> Everybody's loving the whiskers. 
I don't know what the other fuck to call it. <laughs> uh, so instructions. Okay, I know what it is. That's what I've thought. It's a heating pad for when you're have on your period. You mm -hmm. should uh, take it out. How does this thing work? That's pretty cool tech. Yeah, that's it another thing good. I've never had. Yo, you should try it. I've never this. used this it. This seems awesome. Are these expensive? Uh, no. Not too much. Because y'all spend a lot of money on stuff that men don't. I find that, like, shit. Mm. Okay, so it's pretty heavy duty here. It feels almost like a water filter or something. What do you do? You microwave it? Here, I have the directions. It says, remove the adhesive. Attach the top of inner wear. Attach to your clothes? Wait, does it just get hot? How does this work? Is it like a glow stick? You like crack it and it like mm. gets hot? Remove so from paper. I opened one to test it and it got hot like immediately. I didn't I, have to it's like crack air. it, but you could probably like massage it and maybe. Oh, it's supposed to just get activated? Yeah, like yeah. the hand warmers. You should, you oh. should stick it to yourself. Okay. Uh, get on there. So, I'm taking off the adhesive. Okay, let's take the shirt off again. <laughs> Doing this a lot today. There's like an electric version of these two, right? A it's what version, love? Heat, like a like electric pad? versions? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, I use it for my like back. That. Yeah. Mine is Yeah, right on your uterus. Your hair is going to hurt again. Mine is interestingly at a... A uh, 90 degree angle with my abdomen. <laughs> <laughs> gonna pull, I'm gonna cook some of the fat off. Yeah. Isn't it getting warm? Just roll it out. I don't feel anything. No? Nothing. It, it takes a second. It'll, it heats up. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. <laughs> Heat up, baby. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Oh, maybe it's getting warm. It's gonna end up getting. Yeah. Got oh yeah. It's definitely going all the way rare. down, and they pull some moose in there, yeah. and they put some steel beans crossed, yeah. and they cross it from the left, <laughs> they cross it from the right, and they put some cement on top, man, and they came back again, thirty feet of cement. It's not really getting. Oh. All right. Well, everyone's saying you don't stick it to your skin; you stick it to your underwear, and then put that on. So. Oh. <laughs> Burning in their but it's, I don't think it's hot. I mean, am I crazy? Okay. All right, this is cool. Is it a dreidel? <laughs> yeah, it looks like it. it. Could serve as one. Hey, hold on. Let me put this shirt back on. Hey, gather around, kids. We've got the new dreidel. <laughs> So this is some kind of funnel. Is it open or closed? That's what I was wondering too. <laughs> I can't blow through it, but it's an open tube. I guess it's not supposed to open, but then why is there a tube on there? Hmm. Maybe it's not a tube. Wait, it's not a tube? I mean, there's no opening. Wait, does it come through here? Maybe it serves another purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think, I don't believe air is trying right. to do that. Although there is some kind of, um, <laughs> if you look at the edge, there's some kind of serrated, you see that, like a screw? Does it screw into something? <laughs> no. No. No, no, not exactly. Why is there little holes on this side? <laughs> Do you know you feel right? that there was, I mean- This goes in the ear? A little hint, it, I think this thing was mentioned earlier today. Shot glass. You actually do know the name of this thing. Yeah, yeah, it's the, a shot thing glass. That you do people sip earlier. liquid out of it? <laughs> yeah, you yeah. could probably, but some we weirdos about that. probably we don't talk about that. <laughs> okay, genuinely confused about the anatomy of this thing. Hmm. Like I don't understand this tube. It doesn't. Hmm. It'll all become clear in time. <laughs> yes, there you go. We need some tense music. <laughs> Is it one of those things where you squeeze and it opens? Uh, 
Yeah. We don't talk about that. What? <laughs> <laughs> Squeeze and what open? No, at the end, there's like a, I don't understand no. this. No. No. The, 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 the little dangly bit is serves no tunnel-like purpose here. Okay, you putting on I, I know it's a diva cup. I'm just playing. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's, a, she's one of the girlies. But I do I have not say, understand this thing. I've never used one, so how do you use it? I have also never used one, but because I was looking at it, and I was like, "Wait, like have how?" You? I have not either, but I would. I'm interested. Yeah. In I know I know so many people that swear by you like, them. Yeah, fold Doesn't it. Go this way, right? Yeah. yeah. You like that fold it with oh, your fingers. Oh, the tip is for pulling that it out. Like a lot. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Oh. Put the spring on the tampon. Like that. Yeah. Seems like a lot. Imagining you have a vagina. That does seem like a lot. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? To go in. So, so wait, let me. I just, no, yeah, I want to figure this out. So you put it in, you make it small, and then you let it open. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then it, it sits there, right? Like yeah. that whole thing sits in there. Is it not uncomfortable? Would it not be uncomfortable? You get used to it. I, lots think. of people swearing by it in the chat right now. Tampons it's, get like big because yeah. they they're absorbent too. So I feel like that probably wouldn't. And it's this... supposed to be a way cheaper and more environmentally friendly alternative to pads. Mm. Yes. Right. Okay. Uh, tampons, paper products. Okay, this is good intel for me. I'm learning a lot because now. So is this thing? This thing is like nothing gets past it. It's really like protective. Like a linebacker baby. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I don't think it would become successful if something did pass. And do you fill the? How full does the cup get? So they say that per cycle, it's only like one tablespoon, which is so crazy to think about. But I guess that's in a whole week, one tablespoon. So not a lot. That's all. Wait, when you say it's crazy, it seems, seems little whoa. or a lot. That, that sounds a like a little. a little. It sounds like a yeah, little. Yeah, that doesn't too sound little. Yeah, I don't know. I guess a right tablespoon. So how do you just change it once a day? I feel like you would have to do it more often than that, but I haven't Your time used today? it. If anyone so it in seems chat, like a lot of people are saying they haven't used it yet, but want to, or like they don't know how. But then some people that have used it are really happy with it. It's oh, about shit. a shot There's glass a per. Wait, there's a... Oh, a shot glass. So, like, that. makes that. More sense. Hold on, there's a measurement here that's really hard to make out, but it says 10 milliliters, 20 milliliters. Yeah, that's consistent with what I just Googled. So you do it a few times a day? Yeah. And then what if you're at school or at work or something? Right, you just that's... It goes in the toilet, and then you wash it and put it back? Girls in my dorm, it would sometimes... Theirs would sometimes be sitting on the sink. Oh, Ooh, what? Which God. is gross. The cup or the blood? The cup. Bro, that is so vile. Yeah, because you have to wash it after you use it and then put it back. So some girls that is forget. so Someone fucking vile. Someone in chat vile. says they can go twelve hours and it will be three quarters full on a heavy day. Wow. So that's one day. So that's yeah. So the whole tablespoon thing seems. No, it's good. a shot glass. That's people are saying kinda, they don't feel a thing. That's kind of nice if you can have it for twelve hours and not worry about like doing anything. It's like yeah. Sounds good to me, but... And so you take... Mm. So if you need to change it in the middle of the day, you take... I see 12 hours, people are saying, wow. Every 12 hours, is that's kind of a vibe. Someone yeah. says it's great that's until cool. it spills. <laughs> oh. Ew! I don't know, I would imagine, because it's not that airtight. I mean, I don't, I don't know what it's like, but... I feel like some fluid might get past this thing. But, you know, I'm just not sure. Just not sure. Someone says empty it twice a day, so you just you you empty it down the sink or the toilet, you wash it, and then you just pop it back in, and you're good to go, huh? Not so interesting. Do you lube it, or it just pops in there? Do you like Vaseline it? I don't know. I have I to know. assume no. Probably not, right? And does it open all the way when it's inside, or? Oh my God! Somebody said peeing with it is wild. Explain. Well, because they're different holes, right? Yeah, no, I'm just wondering, is it uncomfortable? All different flavors. Different flavors of excrement. <laughs> of vaginal excrement. This is very fucking interesting stuff yeah. here. You know? 
I want to know this stuff. So does it open all but the way? I guess way? if it's for 12 hours, you wouldn't have to change it like when you were at work or at school. No. It's probably not that hard to change though, is it? I mean, you pull it out, you pop no. it in, you switch it. I mean, none of you girls seem to have used it, but... Um, it's suction cups to you. It creates kind of a suction in there, eh? <laughs> Someone says try it. How might you want me to put this up my bum? <laughs> Take a dump in it? <laughs> no, you're talking to us. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, does it open all the way? Or, because it, I mean... Pretty... So different sizes? Or is it one size fits all? Might also, be different how sizes. Do you, there are sure. different sizes, yeah. Okay. So is it easy to pull it out when... Here, try it. I'll do like a little suction and you pull it out. Because I would be scared of like spillage. Right. Pops out. Pull out. Fuck. You guys have a lot to worry about. So, oh, is Diva Cups a product? They're saying we can get them as a sponsor. This one specifically is by Honeypot Company. Oh, so you weren't same. wrong That's a when cute you said they were—they were out of actual Diva cups. Yeah, it's a thing. Whatever happened to the sponge? I remember that was the Seinfeld episode. Is that a real thing? The sponge. I never knew what the sponge was. I remember the episode. <laughs> it's a contraceptive. Yeah, I never. We put it up there, and it like—I guess it wasn't that popular because it's gone. I've never heard of that. I don't know. But the ladies. The ladies swear by the Diva Cup in chat. Those who have used yeah. it, love it. I can imagine it's a lot more affordable too, eh? Because I know tampon or pads mm. I think, are expensive. I think it was between like 20 and 30 bucks, but when you think about how much you have to spend on pads and mm -hmm. liners and stuff, mm -hmm. that's way more affordable. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's just expensive as hell, boy. And they tax wow. you on it too. That's something I can't wrap my head around. You should be free, dude. It's fucked up. Dude, you go to the grocery store, they don't tax groceries and necessary goods. But, they tax fucking menstrual products, which is like, what the fuck? What exactly are you, What exactly does that say? You know? Like, that's, that's not, not essential? Necessary. Yeah. That's not essential. We're saying that... That's why, that's actually why they tax uh, toilet paper as well, because that's not essential either. Do they tax toilet paper? I was just making a joke about how you... I, uh, yeah, I assume so. <laughs> but should they? I guess we all they should. Shouldn't. I was just I was just referencing the fact okay, that they were Okay, funny, but actually you raise a good uh, question. <laughs> <laughs> you do raise a good question. Yeah, I'm pretty sure toilet paper isn't tax exempt. Oh wait, air does come out of it. Okay. Do we have more products? <laughs> I've, I've, this That's the last product. This That's Diva Cup product. has captivated my yeah. imagination. 